vibes, it's Woody, and welcome to this create -a sim video, which it's been so long since I made a create -a sim video. Just a thought. Anyway, <laughs> this video is the doll to doll tag created by Jessica. I believe. I'm like 99.999% sure on that. I will leave a link to her channel in the description down below. I don't know if I was tagged by anyone. I probably wasn't, but that's okay. I am being wild and I'm doing it anyway. Obviously, the name of this tag is just supposed to sound like sort of a pun kind of thing. Or I'm not saying the sim before was dull or whatever. It's just like, you know, I don't know. I guess it's a pun. Would you consider that a pun? Dull to dull. It's a thought. Think about that tonight when you can't fall asleep. Anyway, um, I will put this sim who I named Reyna up on the gallery if you would like to download her and... I'll list the CC that I used on her in the description box down below, so you can download those things too if you would like. I tried out a new skin for this sim, it's a new one that was just released by Hab Sims today, or at least on the day I'm filming this, because who knows when this video is going to go up. And I, I was kind of unsure about it at first, because I'm really in love with the uh, Noodle Sims and D Death Flowers skins those two combined I just think they're gorgeous but I really like this one and it's a blend with the noodle sims one so that's probably why I partially like it this part right here where I'm not doing anything was because my cat like wanted in my room and then I was trying to like lick my bowl of noodles I was eating and then I had to kick him out it's a really exciting story so you can see uh, we stopped moving for a minute here but then we get back in action so the look I was going for with this doll inspired sim was I looked up dolls on Tumblr just because I didn't really, you know, know exactly what kind of doll to make because there's plenty of different kinds of dolls. And I found these things. Oh, what were they called? Uh, they were like ball jointed dolls, I think. BJD was like what they were called. And they're like incredibly realistic. So I kind of tried to model her off of one of those. They look very similar to like Disney characters with the big spread far apart eyes. And that's kind of what I went for. It was interesting to do this because I realized it made me make the sim who's a little bit different than what I would normally make. Like I made her eyes quite a bit bigger than I would normally make on a sim and they're not too much farther apart than I normally put them but her chin is like a pointed or chin it, like she has kind of a heart-shaped face and that's not something I've really done a whole lot but it ended up looking super pretty on her and I was really into it to be honest so uh, I was quite quite pleased with that 10 out of 10 would recommend and the hairs that I used on her one this one right here was from oh my gosh can it, wild spit I believe. Yeah. Yeah. And the other hair that I used is from uh, Hollow Sprite. I think I got that right. And I put these little star stickers on her face that I think are so cute, but like, I don't know. I forgot to take screenshots with them on and already closed out of my game. I don't want to open it back up. Now I'm a lazy. I'm a lazy. I'll probably put it up for download with the star stickers on her face. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, they're, they weren't in the thumbnail for this video because I took them off when I was doing her other outfit. Uh, ah, ah, whatever, doesn't really matter. <laughs> I was, just, I'm, you know, recording this on Audacity, and that sound I just made, the sound waves looked very strange there. This dress is so cute. I, oh, who created this? It's like Sims Life F O U, something like that. It's so adorable, and then socks because I love my socks. The socks I'm wearing today, what do they say on them, actually? They say, like, a pun on them, but now I don't remember. And they have cats on them. What do they say? I can't read them upside down. I'm sure they say something really exciting. <laughs> now I'm sitting so weird on my chair. This voiceover is a mess. <laughs> ah! Okay. Let's see. What are we doing here? We're doing some makeup. We're on her formal wear. And, uh, yeah, I use, this is a hair from Hollow Sprite that I use. It kind of, like, messed up her eyelashes, which I've only really seen that happen when I used alpha hairs. So, it's kind of like, hmm, that's weird. But I don't mind it too much. If it bothers you, then you could probably just not use this hair on her. But I really liked it, and I thought it just really went with the Marby theme. So, I decided to keep it. Yup. And then this is athletic wear. You know, basic things. All of her outfits were super easy to do. I didn't spend, I think I spent a total of like 27 minutes making her and I had a lot of fun doing so. She's 
kind of supposed to look like a porcelain doll. <laughs> Her torso was invisible there for a second. So yeah, I gave her the blonde hair because like I said, I was working off of one of those BJD dolls. <laughs> I think that was kind of repetitive because it was ball jointed dolls dolls. Anyway, I just kind of trying to do that and I, I gave her freckles, right? I can't even tell in the video because it's in a lower quality right now that I'm recording this so my computer doesn't lag. But yeah, I gave her some freckles, but I didn't do like the eye bags or anything like that because she's supposed to look like a doll. And, you know, that's not typically to that point of realisticness. But we're coming up to the end of the video right here. Her name is Reyna, by the way. Did I ever say that? I don't even know. So she'll be up on the gallery. My origin ID is Real Sim Sweetie, and I will also have that written in the description. So if you want to download her and tag put pictures tag me in it and uh yeah have fun and uh, you're all beautiful goodbye <laughs> new tagline i guess